What's up, y'all? It's your boy Leon M. Tukulu. Welcome to my channel. Like if you like my video, subscribe if you're not subscribed. About to dive right into uh, the originals episode two. I really love this episode. This episode was just like a glimpse into what's to come. Like it was big. We got a moment where we they started off with a moment with hope with the earphone headsets on. I mean, and. They show you a dream. We got a little hope back for a little bit. The moment where Klaus kind of stopped talking to her. And I saw why. I was like, yo, Klaus is not good with emotions. And he just saw his, his little daughter like in horror of what he was, what he was doing. I understand his mission. They explained it in episode one. But that was a big moment, like hope and Klaus are stealing the spotlight this season, like the beginning episodes, and I, they did it on purpose, no lie. Uh, Klaus reuniting with Freya was a cute moment, because they started butting heads when Freya showed up. Then we also had Marcel and Klaus have a, a sweet moment, but the way Klaus is so not wanted in New Orleans is it's funny. Uh, Vincent and Freya's relationship is still a plus for me. Like I didn't expect these two people to work so well, like as partners, and it works. Um, uh, Hope's love interest, that vampire dude, finding out the truth, going all the way to Hope. That was suspicious. I think this dude is working for somebody. Uh, Vincent's love interest, that fortune teller woman, she fine as hell though. When they had that fortune teller session where it seemed like hope was actually the savior, but nah, she ended up being like uh, the downfall of um, of New Orleans, like the future foretold that she was going to be the downfall of New Orleans, which I'm, I'm interested in how they're going to attack that type of story. So how about that, that sire of hope, that hybrid? That got murdered at the end of the episode. That shocked me. That took me back. Like, yo, this was a good episode. I give it an 8 out of 10. Still trying to understand who's behind all these things. Who took Haley and all these moments. Hope started a lot of things. Just trying to, you know, reconcile with her father. But, yeah, overall, it was a great episode. Really enjoyed it. Had a lot of hope and Klaus moments. That were amazing. You saw their character grow, especially that end where Hope thought, "Yo, my dad doesn't love me." Then he leaves by saying, "I love you." Then he basically rushes away. Like it's, the story is just beautiful. Like I said, eight out of ten. Subscribe if you're not subscribed already. I'm about to dive into the promo for the third episode. Yeah. Who's this? It's Elijah driven episode, yo. I'm excited. Because Elijah's had those piano moments. And he's a beast. Elijah's a beast. Elijah is a beast. I want to see him unleashed. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, like if you like my review, my reaction. Subscribe if you're not subscribed to the channel. Deuces.